Hey there guys, it's me, Tucker, and I'm back again with another Funko Pop review. Um, actually, this time with a two-pack um, Pop figure review um, that, that came in a two-pack. Um, I, I got I have right here the Hot Topic exclusive of SpongeBob and Patrick from, from the SpongeBob SquarePants line. I think this is a continuation of the second wave of Spongebob Squarepants pop figures because uh, on the back of the box that these two came in they had some of the um, previously released figures but yeah um, these are these are um, the Hot Topic exclusives of Spongebob and Patrick I mean I have Spongebob Squarepants and Patrick Star um, and as you can see they're both wearing matching t-shirts that say best friend and they're pointing at each other because you know Obviously, SpongeBob and Patrick are best friends. Everybody knows that. And yeah, these are these are really cool. I've never, I've never had any pop figures of SpongeBob, let alone of SpongeBob and Patrick. So it's, it, I, it's really cool to get these. I, I think, I think, I think there was an actual episode where both SpongeBob and Patrick were wearing these T-shirts. I think they actually wore these T-shirts -shir in an episode, but I'm. I'm not sure what the name of that episode is, but anyway, on to the review. Um, I think I will start off with Patrick first, since he's my favorite. Be right back. Okay, so starting off the review, we have Patrick. Um, so yeah, you know, very nice representation of Patrick. I think this is definitely a a total upgrade, like compared to the original pa Patrick pop figure that was released that that one was just terrible it looked like his his, his face was on his stomach this is definitely a, a much better looking Patrick figure um but yeah you know um he he looks exactly like Patrick pointy head um pointy arms uh the feet not so much but i mean i understand that they had to make him stand um he's got a goofy smile with um one tooth showing. I mean, I, I think Patrick usually has like one tooth or no teeth. Well, I mean, he, he has teeth, but I mean, they don't really like, they're not as prominent as SpongeBob's. And he's wearing his shirt that says best friend and it's pointing to the left. Yeah. He's got his hands on his belly or, um, or his arms at least. But I don't think he really has hands. Yeah, and there's his shorts um, with the purple flowers. Or at least I think those are flowers. Yeah, all in all, very nice representation of Patrick. I think they they got everything down correctly. Like um, the look of the character and like the color of his shorts and his and like the pink of his skin. The only complaint I have, however, is that um, I I don't know if anyone notices, but in the show, Patrick usually has like some small red dots all over his body like on like I think there's one on top of his head like like covered in his body like there's one on top of his head and on his arms and his belly I kind of wish um Funko uh gave that that to this figure but all in all it's really nice Patrick is definitely my favorite character on Spongebob and I'm I'm really glad to finally have a, a Patrick uh, pop figure in my collection all right, moving on with SpongeBob. All right, and here he is, the man himself, the absorbent and yellow Mr. SpongeBob SquarePants. Yeah, I, I gotta say, as much as I like the Patrick figure, it's really cool to have a SpongeBob figure in my collection too. I mean, SpongeBob is a really big cartoon star. I mean, I, I'd even say that he's like the face of, of Nickel. He's like the Bugs Bunny or the Mickey Mouse of Nickelodeon. I mean, he, he has been around since the 90s, and, he's, and his show's still going strong. I mean, he's had three movies and and even a Broadway musical. Well, you get the idea. All right, so looking at the figure, um, very nice. Very, I, I think he's very cute. I, I think the Patrick figure was cute, too. Um, you got the the black Funko eyes with um, his eyelashes added. Um, he's got, like, a big smile because, I mean... You know, SpongeBob, he, he's generally a really happy character. He's usually always seen smiling. And he got his two buck teeth. And, um, you know, and obviously he's square because he's a sponge. I mean, nice detail, like um, like um, how curvy 
it is on the side and like the holes on his body, like holes right here. Kind of almost reminds me of cheese. Yeah. And uh, you got his um, his best friend shirt, which um, says best friend. It's pointing to the right, which will be pointing at Patrick. Um, yeah, and you got his square pants. I'm not really sure if he's wearing like his red tie and stuff underneath the shirt, but it's possible. Um, one thing that confuses me is that how his his sleeves aren't attached to his shirt. I mean, even with his regular shirt, that's just that's just funny. But I mean, SpongeBob's entire body is his head. Um, yeah, and you got his socks and his shoes. I'd say these are very accurate to the cartoon, like the colors and the stripes on the socks. Very nice, very very cool. I I, I think th they got this SpongeBob down to a to a T. I'm I'm really impressed. And he doesn't have any articulation because it's just one piece. He doesn't really have any head articulation, and neither does Patrick. I mean, I thought Patrick would have head articulation, but I mean, I can understand why they didn't have make Patrick poseable. I mean, it, it's hard to tell. I mean, looking at him, it's hard to tell where his neck or, or would start and or or end. Ironically, I don't think starfish even have necks, but I mean, it's a cartoon. But yeah, both of these are really, really good. I'm very satisfied. Um, I think if Steven Hillenburg saw these, he would be proud. All right, now I'm gonna make some comparisons. All right, now like I said, I don't have any other SpongeBob pop figures, so I'm going to improvise by comparing these two to my other Hot Topic exclusives, starting with Woody holding Forky. Um, standing next to each other, um, Hmm. I'd say Patrick is just about almost taller. Um, actually, hang on. Yeah, I'd say Patrick's almost taller. Yeah, and SpongeBob's obviously shorter than Woody. Yeah. All right. Next comparison. All right. And my next comparison, I'm going to be comparing them with my hot top of exclusives of Moo Moo Homer and Nelson Muntz from The Simpsons. All right. Um. Now with Homer, uh, yeah, well, SpongeBob, excuse me. All right, sorry about that. I had to go take care of something. As I was saying, um, my Moo Moo Homer figure, he's he's definitely taller than SpongeBob, and I want to say that Patrick is about an inch taller than him. Um, with Nelson, on the other hand, okay, well, I mean, N Patrick's obviously... Well, Patrick's obviously been taller than all the other figures I compared. Um, what well, with his pointy head. Standing next to SpongeBob, um, hmm. Let me see. I'd say SpongeBob and Nelson are around the same height. Okay, yeah. And yeah, that just about wraps up my Funko Pop review of the two pack exclusive of SpongeBob and Patrick in their best friend t shirts. Very, very cool set of figures. Very cute. My siblings my, my siblings both think they both look creepy for some reason. I think they look adorable. But yeah, I, I, I definitely recommend this set. Um, if you like to collect pop figures or if you're a fan of SpongeBob, I would definitely love to get more SpongeBob pop figures in general. I mean, ma ma mainly mostly just figures of Patrick since he's my favorite character, but I wouldn't mind having a couple more having a couple more SpongeBob figures around but yeah th that was my Funko Pop review of the Hot Topic exclusive two pack of SpongeBob and Patrick be sure to like comment subscribe and as always I'll see you guys later bye bye